It's June, so that means game announcements. Yesterday we got a new Pokemon trailer for Violet and Scarlet. Today we got a new state of play. Uh, and I'm really only wanting one thing, and that's a God of War Ragnarok announcement date. Or release date. You know? That's all I need. Outside of that, I'm, I'm along for the ride, man. Like, please. Just give me some good stuff. Let's get into it, man. Two seconds. Blow me away. The old PS5. Hmm. Three, twenty-four, twenty twenty-three. What is it? Which game is coming out next year? Um Resident Evil, maybe? Nope. Yep. Four remake. Yes, 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 yes. Four is the only Resident Evil I've played. How's it how good's it look? How good's it look? Dude. I'm gonna have to call my brother after this. Like I have. Yo, dog. Like on the GameCube, man, like straight up. I put some time in Resident Evil 4 back in the day. This looks so good. This looks insanely good. They just coming out of the gates fucking charging, dude. Look at this! Man, I got so many people to text after this. What are you buying? Wow. Our most sacred body. It begins now. Dude, that's hype. That's hype as fuck. That is so hype. That looks incredible. That looks so good. March of next year. If I could just forget what happened that night. It's okay, Leon. Even for a second. We all had a crush on Ashley back in the day, dude. It can be different. Look at this! It has to. Damn, dude. Okay, that's that's exciting. That is so exciting. Everybody knew it was coming, but like... Okay. VR, I like, I know everybody like talks super highly about... So, um, State of play returns, and we've got some great PlayStation updates to share with you today. And thanks to Capcom for kicking it off with Resident Evil 4, coming to PS5 with PlayStation VR2 content. That's exciting. Development. Now let's get a sneak peek at four games in development for PlayStation VR2. Is this going to be like specifically VR related? I didn't think about that. Now, let's take a look at. Step on me. You escaped my little Lady Demetri... Oh my god, I can never say it right. Demetri... I can't. I'm not even going to attempt. Yes, mother. Yes, mother. People going to be acting up so bad in VR with this game, dude. Like, I already know people are going to be doing... People going to be horny on main way too hard. <laughs> Pun fully intended. That's exciting, man. I'm not a VR person, but I know there's going to be some funny memes come out of that. VR makes me nauseous. Like, the only time I played VR, it made me really sick. Have the audacity to question me? 
you dying light who emerged from the putrid waters of the bayou no to plunder our righteous gains and cut our throats like a demon in the night what have you done to ensure the future of this forsaken city you who have brought nothing but chaos is this like back for blood or when death was swallowing this city hole, it was I who resurrected it. It was I who shined as a beacon of hope for all. The tower cries out for blood, and I vow to spill it. When the bells ring, the song they sing will be righteous. Retribution. Ah, uh, okay. Welcome home, tourist. My Walking Dead days are over. I don't know, I mean, zombie games are just kind of played out right now. They're just so formulaic. Oh, dude, No Man's Sky? Dude, I would absolutely... Okay, all right. I have not played No Man's Sky since it came out, but the ship flying aspect of it was like the thing I love the most. Flying a ship in VR in this game, I bet, would be incredible. Interesting. There. Horizon. Where are you taking me? Yeah, that's Horizon. I asked you a question. I remember they mentioned something about this before. Uh, maybe it was last year. This is a good shot. Yeah, and it would air off through both of us. You're switching with me. This kind of feels like a rail shooter. I still need to play uh, the New Horizons. I haven't done it yet. I need to get it. There's just so many games on my backlog. Oh my god. Blameless Murad had me released from prison. But why? What a beautiful game. Redemption is still possible, Reyes. Climb the mountain. Find out why the machines are attacking. Oh, dude, that's hype, actually. Link's crossbow training, VR. Do that, and you shall be a free man. It will take all your wits, your skills, and courage. in the shadows, Reyes. Call of the Mountain, yeah. I'm pretty sure like they showed some stuff about this last year as well. Thunderjaw, dude. Hi, That's dope. I'm Ben McCaw, narrative director at Guerrilla. I hope you enjoyed your first look at Horizon ben, Call of the Mountain. Why don't you give me kills on three? The PlayStation VR two. We're also happy you announced that a big update to Horizon Forbidden West, including New Game Plus, will be available to download on PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5 today. Nice. Major update. Performance mode. Transmog. Sweet. So cool, man. I need to play. God, man, I gotta. All right, that's gonna be for one of my summer games for update, sure. Please check out PlayStation Blog. From all of us at Gorilla, thank you for your continued support, and please stay tuned for more updates to come. Get ready, a PlayStation fan favorite is coming to PC. Bloodborne. 
All right, I'm gonna I'm I'm if it's Bloodborne, dude, I'm gonna minimize and watch the chat go crazy. Okay, it's not. Sacrificing and Spider Man. So <laughs> if you want to change the world, you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions. Do you really need two of those? You are everything that's wrong with this city. I'm gonna go. Uh... Do your thing. You can't just push people around like that. Just ask for help next time. Time to bring back the glory days. August 12th? Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Hmm. Yay, Stray! Okay, alright, I've been wanting to see more gameplay on this. I like the music, man. The music's good. Meow. <laughs> That's cute. Damn, man. The music's good. A cat platformer, dude. Who who wouldn't love this? This looks incredible. Not actual gameplay. Okay. Still looks good. July 19th? Okay, that's relatively soon. I kind of wasn't expecting that. Speaking of cats, mine is beating the door down. Explore a mysterious cyber city in Stray. Coming to PS5 and PS4 July 19th. PlayStation Plus extra members and higher can download Stray at no extra cost when it launches next month. Up next, three games that will get your heart racing. Hmm. Racing games? No. Dead Space. Striking Distance Studios. Is this that, um... Crafton? This has got to be that Calypso or uh, pro the Take Protocol. Did you know that they call Callisto the dead? Yes, 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 yes. Dead. New Cosmic Horror game that's like Dead Space. The original Dead Space creator is making this game. So whatever you're holding on to right there, that's your old life. Damn, man. That go. God, that, the fucking, that looks so good. life is entirely in my hands. I'm just trying to give you a chance at rebirth. Cut off their limbs. Dude, oh my god. I'm excited for the Dead Space remake, don't get me wrong, but like... I love that last part. I feel like this... It would be better to support the original creator instead of EA, you know? They did him so dirty. Dude, this looks fucking incredible. Oh my god. When is this coming out, man? December! Oh my god. Okay, alright, alright. That's right after Pokemon. Surely I will be done by Pokemon by then. That's Yeah, I'm very excited for that. That looks so good. sport grips the globe 
and in the arena. There will only be the victorious and the dead. I kind of love this. Little Tony Hawk Pro Skater. BR fucking like. Not necessarily BR, but just like multiplayer shooter, you know? That looked incredible. That looked absolutely incredible. Sometimes I wonder if things will ever be normal again. Anime. Captured on PS5. Why does this look like Astral Chain? I know it's not, but I don't know. Maybe it's... Is it Astral Chain? I never played it. I don't know. I don't know. It looked good, though. I would watch this anime. Eater Knights, Etern Knights, Studio Side. Never heard of them. Kowloon Knights. Yeah, I'm not familiar with any of that. It looked interesting. Action games and dating sims collide in Etern Knights, coming to PS5 and PS4 next year. Mm, who do I want my waifu to, to be? Look at an upcoming heavy hitter. Kind of like the pink-haired girl. Capcom heavy hitter. Fighting game. Is this a Street Fighter? Probably Street Fighter. When you go looking for strength, it's not like a game. This journey doesn't have a real ending. Okay then, we'll be ready to begin. Art sounds fucking start dope. Off right foot in this city. Hit the streets. Yeah, hey there, do this. Never fear lose. And when I get up in the Thank you. Didn't want to Didn't want to monetize this reaction at all. No.
Hadouken! Okay! Damn, shouty! Why is she so thick? Your moment. I'm not a fighting game guy anymore. I hung that towel up a long time ago. That was your first look at Street Fighter 6. It looked good though. Mark your calendars. It comes to PS5 and PS4 in 2023. Now it's time for two indie adventures arriving later this year. Tunic's already out, is it not? On PS5, I mean. Like, I know it's out already. Is Tunic not out on PS5? That's how I was gonna play it. I really want this game on Switch. Like, so badly, I want this game on Switch. You don't even know. I was really upset to find out that it wasn't on Switch. I don't know why I said Switch weird. Dog, it's not even on PlayStation yet? What? What? Alright, I guess I'm getting Game Pass just for, you know, <laughs> just to play Tunic. She set out to record this is pretty. At the end of this, season to make it real for people in the future. this is so pretty. She asked us about living together. And we asked her about traveling alone. When the season turns, what will remain? Is this a farming game? I'm so in if this is a farming what game. What she saw. What she captured. Ah, it's a photography game. She carries the sounds of the season. That's so pretty, dude. What kind of game is this? The way she listened made you want to tell her everything. I got to look in her journal. The world was telling her its secrets. I think she even figured out what will happen to us. Dude, this and game is gorgeous. Nice. What a pretty game. Look at those big Studio Ghibli fucking clouds. Is it gone? Not yet. What kind of game is this, dude? Season, A Letter to the Future. Autumn 2022. Interesting. Very, very beautiful color palette. Final Fantasy update was expected. Never played Final Fantasy, not a Final Fantasy guy, but I will be excited for you Final Fantasy fans out there. Uh, Based. Sephiroth, is that you? Us, that its immaculate aspect might reveal itself. The icon. There's going to be another war, is 
of that. Every day we delay brings us closer to disaster. We must move now. he would wreak would sweep all of Valisthea into the abyss. I unite the dominance, that we may bring an end to the strife and found a new order to see... I just know Alex McCullough is going to have a version of this theme on Twitter in like 30 minutes. This looks awesome, but like, I don't know, man. I'm just like, I, I've never played Final Fantasy, so like, the hype is lost on me. It still looks really good. Like, the enemy designs are just fucking badass, man. They're like biblically accurate uh, angels. Yet for every citizen who falls, another can be bred. Every home that burns, another can be built. The Empire will live on. Interesting. Awaken. Next summer. Yeah, that's cool. I'm sure Final Fantasy fans will be happy. And that's a wrap. Don't forget to visit PlayStation. Play All right, not bad. Even more about today's announcement. Not bad. See you next time. No God of War announcement, which is really surprising to me. It's supposed to come out this year, so unless I don't know, man. That's holiday. That's a holiday game for sure. But yeah, man, very interesting. Um, only 30 minutes. I was kind of expecting it to be a little bit longer, you know, because this is... I mean, Sony's kind of started going their own, own way and, like, uh, ha are doing, like... They're kind of following the Nintendo method of doing their own thing, but, like, I don't know, man. June is the big time to show off games, and uh, they didn't really show anything off here. That's, uh, or not... They showed off a ton of stuff. Don't get me wrong. I'm just saying, like, I expected this to be a little bit longer and then probably to show a good bit more, but... Uh, Either way, I think what they did show was uh, was really good. Um, a lot of VR-focused stuff, which is kind of to be expected, I guess, with um, them making a um, a push with their new VR for P like PS5 specifically. Um, Tunic not coming out until September is heartbreaking, so I guess I'll be playing that on PC. Um, Maybe a Switch version will come out before then. But, yeah, there's some very interesting stuff here. Uh, the rollerblading game looked really good. Um, obviously, the VR Horizons looks incredible. Um, yeah, that, I don't know, man. This was I feel like this was good. Um, a lot of big stuff. Spider-Man going to PC. Stray looks really good. So, uh, the Callisto Protocol, of course, looks incredible. So, yeah, I don't know. I think it's, um, I think it's really good. Um obviously it's missing some stuff i feel but like I, th I feel like this was a good state of play but yeah um yeah i don't know man no final fantasy 7 remake news which is interesting but yeah final fantasy uh 16 interesting uh but yeah that's going to do it guys thank you so much for watching this reaction let me know what you're excited about um is there anything that's super stand out uh stand outish uh from this state of play that you're really excited for i know callisto protocol is probably like a big one for me just because i like uh dead space so much um but yeah man like um uh, i think this was good i think it was good let me know what you think down below subscribe if you haven't already we are almost at 2,000 subscribers and uh please stay tuned for more coverage of new games hopefully some uh breath of the wild 2 news this month we can all hope. But anyways, that's going to do it, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. And until next time, I will see you in the next one.